So, uh, can you guess what the name of this company is? Blue Monaco. Remember, I might have mentioned that name to you a few times in the last two videos. Uh, Blue Monaco. Remember Blue Monaco? So, this company is super awesome. And I think there's sorcery at play here because they are totally reading my mind. I mean, I'm, I gotta get a chair so I can come over here and... and bask in the wonderfulness of Blue Monaco. So, I, if you see what my bed looks like behind me, I'm so sorry. What I did was, is I took everything off my dresser. I mean everything. And I'm, I'm in this cleaning spree where I want to organize. There's so much jewelry. There's so much... There's just so much stuff in more. You ever just get overloaded with, alright, to say you're overloaded with jewelry, I got jewelry that I haven't even opened the boxes, and I kind of feel ashamed of that. Um, but the reason why is because it's not organized. So, anyway, Blue Monaco. Uh, for me, Blue Monaco is a new company. It may not be a new company, I don't know, but for me, it's a new company. So, in that box that I just showed you, look at this. It is beautiful. Now, it feels like leather. I don't know if it's leather. Blue Monaco! Anyway. Little open thingy here. I'm sorry. I'm trying to do this. Uh, hold on. I'm going to put you down on top of a jewelry box. With a kitten. Bye, kitten. Just really quick. Okay. So you just push that little side button there, and then it opened right up. So, let me see. There was a little piece of plastic. It's gone. Alright, so inside is, we'll get rid of this first, is ring trays and some, ooh, ooh, that moves. Oh, do you know what these are? These are for your watches. If you have watches, you can put your watches or different, certain kind of bracelets. Oh, that is so awesome. So there's two of them. This tray lifts up and then underneath is some, oh, uh, this is just beautiful. Do they move at all? No. So, uh, it's a little off-kilter, but that really doesn't matter. You know what I mean, off-kilter? In other words, those <laughs> I thought it was me for a minute. The squares are a little bit leaning, but that's not a big deal. So then, I see this here, and I wonder what this is. So I guess if you wanted to, you could hide something back there. But I think that really you can use it like this. So it's the mirror is dirty because I just took it out of its box. So, but you could use that as like your vanity mirror. That's pretty awesome. But you can actually just stick something, you know, it's it could be like a false back there. Uh, some letters or something. I don't know. So, okay, I showed you the little watch things. Oh, let's see what this is. Ooh. Hey, you know what? This, whole, well, this whole thing could be like a travel jewelry case, but let's say you were going away. You could actually just put this in your in your bag in your um, travel bag. Your I would I always just take a carry on bag. I put everything inside. I, I just put everything inside the carry on bag anymore because this way you don't have to worry about it getting lost. Um, my I remember years ago, my mother in law all her stuff disappeared, and so after that, 
I always just did carry-ons. So when I was saying that I have jewelry that I haven't opened up, you're just going to want to slap me when you see what's inside these boxes. If I can even open them up. My, um, oh, here is a Pandora bracelet still in the baggie that I have not even put on yet. So, um, I actually, I need, and what was neglected, what they neglected to mention when you order these already built bracelets, they neglect to tell you that the, um, original is like a child size, and that you should choose your bracelet size. There wasn't even a drop-down menu to choose. It was just choose your thing. So, of course, I didn't know to order a larger size uh, bracelet that goes with it. I had no clue. So, uh, a part of the reason is, this is the frozen bracelet, I think. Or winter, I'm not sure. Oh, it's so pretty. Anyway, that is really why it's been sitting in the box. I got to take it to Pandora and be like, hey, um, when I got this, they didn't tell me to, uh, to do this, this, this. So here is another Pandora that I got as a gift. And this is also, oh, this is spring. This is the spring one. And I love this one, but again, it is a really a child size bracelet. You see how tiny it is? And not that that's really that tiny because I only need like a half an inch. I have really, really like this bracelet is too big on me. Like I have really, really thin wrists, but this is a child size bracelet. So will it be here? No, it, it, it's. It's even too small for the watchy thing. So I got two Pandoras that I need to take care of. Where's number two? And a company sent me these as a gift, and I I love them. I just got to take them to get the bigger bracelet. So another company that has some pretty awesome stuff and it's a silly name but it's called oops and what it is is you can put different discs inside here like this one is an owl so will any of these boxes fit in there no so i'll have to just put them in the thing well um with the blue monaco jewelry boxes uh, what's really nice is that there's all different styles. Here's some discs that go with the oops. You, know, you can just get different discs to go in there to switch it up. Mm, so cool. You get a little key to go with your jewelry box. That's awesome. I love it. Um, I It's just beautiful. Like... I said before, I feel extremely blessed that I get to um, review items, and this is definitely beautiful. I can say that the craftsmanship is really nice. The only thing that I would say um, is that the bottom tray, everything is slanted. so. Some people may not be really thrilled with that. And I would imagine that if you got this jewelry box and you looked at it and you were like, wow, the things are diagonal. They're just slightly a little bit. It's nothing major, but if it bothers you, I'm sure that they will. You know which ones it is? It's the top two rows. There's the six six squares. It's that. And let me see if it moves. That's what I was looking before to see. Oh, 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 they move. 
Oh, I'm so glad that I looked. I mean, that I, um, I, what I was going to say is, what I have found with all these companies, if there's something wrong, they want to fix it. They don't want you to return their item. They want you to be happy customers. So now I am seriously happy. I was happy anyway, and it didn't bother me that um, they were slanted like that. But now I know all I had to do was just move them. So it actually, it comes out. <laughs> so that means if you don't want these and you just want to put your boxes in there, you can put your boxes in. Or I like this idea better though. I like the fact that you can have, it's like, this is like your Noah's Ark for your jewelry, and everybody has their own little space. So, um, I have things that, you know, I wish they were more at my fingertips. Like, this is in a pouch, and when it's in a pouch, I forget. I'm like, what is it? So, it's so lovely. But it's in a pouch, and the pouch is fine. But now, I'm going to put it inside here, and then I'm going to see it. I'm going to see it, and I'm going to wear it. So, you see? Now, this is going to be, like, in your face. I mean, if you want, you can always just put the pouches underneath it if you don't want to get rid of your pouches. But... With my things in the pouch, it's like out of sight, out of mind. I have a lot of, I have a lot of jewelry. This, uh, I used to be, I'm still kind of chubby, but I used to be really chubby. And when I say really chubby, I mean really chubby. So I would imagine that this is, uh, this is from when I was really, we'll call me beefy. <laughs> I have a feeling that this is too big for me. Um, but I really, not to disrespect the old kind of, um, jewelry boxes like this, but they're kind of out of style. So I love this kind of thing because they are, that, it's not that they're out of style, but they're out of style. You know what I mean? Like if you got one, hey, it's nice. But if you got something like this, it's even better. Uh... I'm kind of, I'm kind of over this because I don't even know what's in here. They've been in here so long and I really, I really don't even look in there. I kind of forgot what I had. So, and I have some really nice stuff. What is that? Oh, I forgot about that. I have this. I actually, I have to, um, I have to clean it because it's silver but it is a leaf. You see how intricate that is? But um, it definitely needs to be cleaned. It is that I had this hang. This was um, I had it on this so that um, it would hang and not drag. I used that. And oh. This here, uh, this was a present when I had my second son. So see, it's a husband and a wife and two kids. And I honestly, I honestly forgot that I even had this. I mean, that's, that's why I really don't like that kind of jewelry box. Because here, I, I forgot, I forgot that I had it. So, oh well. My, um, my light just went off because it's telling me that my battery is starting to die. So, <laughs> battery, you're not the boss of me. Oh, yes, it is. So <laughs> it's very much the boss of me. Anyway, Blue Monaco, I will revisit this because, uh, I want to put my jewelry in and then I'm going to show you what it looks like, but I love it. And the workmanship, I, I can't find anything that I don't like about it. Like I said, I thought it was lopsided, but then I'm, I, I realized you can move it, so it can, it can be unlopsided. It's my wedding rings from my first husband died, but I still have my wedding ring from my 
my first, my marriage, and I, every once in a while I wear it. I don't know why. Um, I guess because he was my first love, and I feel like I feel like we're meant to be together. Like I did get married again, but it was never like it was with my first husband. It, we were just so so free you know it was just so free if that makes any sense so I felt so myself and I never got that again and so before he died he like asked me not to get married again so that we could be together again one day so I'm not married anymore so maybe maybe we will be together again one day who knows did I get nostalgic over my wedding ring? I think I did. Yeah, I even forgot I had these earrings. And I have another really beautiful pair of earrings that my son gave me, too. So, I love that this is, like, taking me down memory, memory lane. So, I will remake an ending of the video uh, after I charge my phone and I put my jewelry in here. So, just remember that this is Blue Monaco. You saw that I had the jewelry tree, which is so awesome. And the desk set that has the rosettes, just beautiful. So just remember that name, Blue Monaco. They have a boatload of products and so many really nice jewelry uh, boxes. And I will, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to post the link to this jewelry box. But I'm going to do a site walk. You know, like window shopping through their site and show you everything. Uh, I'll do that when I get some time. So, thanks for watching. And uh, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. And uh, I will do the ending uh, when my phone charges. And so this way, you know, and there's light. Because the light goes off like... <laughs> anyway. See you in a bit. Bye.